All right, I'm the Fly Rate Master, and this is something I haven't said for a while. I got some new tools. I haven't done these videos for a while because new tools have been pretty far and, well, you know, not a whole lot of stuff has come out that, well, interest me. So, been a minute since I've done one of these videos, so I figured I would bring you along. Now, the first one we're going to talk about, Milwaukee did not send it to me. I paid for it. I bought it with my own money and that is a Milwaukee Sawzall. The reason I bought this is my old DeWalt has finally bit the dust. It was corded, it was old, it died. So I bought a Milwaukee. If you don't know, it's not a brand new tool. They don't sample it, so I had to buy this. This isn't one of those tools that you use often in auto repair, but when you need it, you really need it. Stuck control arm bolts, just saying. So, got me that. All right, next tool is from Vim. It is part number STWE12. It is a heavily offset E12 internal Torx for BMW starters. Apparently, this is something that is really nice to have. So, you know, if you do work on BMWs, you probably already know about this, but if you don't, Late model BMW starter bolts, kind of essential. All right, next thing I got, now this is just nothing real, real amazing, but it is a keep alive for a jump box. My old one is starting to, well, fray and time for a new one. Not a lot of modern cars. It's not that effective, especially, you know, with gateway modules and stuff like that. But for older Hondas, it comes in really handy for not having to find radio codes, so. Essential around here. All right, next one we got is a very, very specialized tool. Volkswagen Audi Group air conditioning tube removal tool. Now, Volkswagen Audi have these weird AC connections and you need these special tools to get them to release. I don't know how else you would do them without these, but now, one of the things about these connectors is we actually had the owner of the company that designed them. We were working on his Volkswagen Audi. It was an Audi, I believe. And they were leaking. He swore up and down his fittings never leak. I don't lie. They were leaking. So <laughs> we had to replace those. Cole did it back a few, a while ago. But anyway, these are the tools for him. I haven't used him. Cole bought his own back then. Nobody had them anymore. I saw one, I'm like, oh, I need those connector, disconnect tools. So it is part number 4472 from JTC. The last tool I bought isn't staying at the shop. It's actually going home. And that is this snap-on torch. <laughs> because my $100 cigar lighter, tabletop cigar lighter is, dying again, out of warranty again, and I'm not spending another $100 to replace it again when I can just buy one of these. So, saw it on the truck, I'm like, oh, okay, I'll grab it. So, this isn't for the shop, it's for home use. So, hope you enjoyed this video. As always, thanks for watching. I am the Fly Rate Master.